Welcome back to Cut Above Tarot, Aries. Aries, 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 Aries. Aries, 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 Aries. Sun, moon, rising, Venus, and other places. Please like, share, subscribe, and comment. Get in where you fit in, Aries. And if you don't find it in this video, please check your other placement. And I'll see you there, too, if you're cruising and viewing. All views are appreciated. Returning subscriber, thank you for your support and checking in for a friend as an Aries. Hey, friend. Now, nah, I have Aries in their chart. Aries, this is your breakfast message. Yay, yay. All right. And it's in love. All right. So first of all, I want to tell you that I pulled you some romance oracle cards, angel. Okay. And your first card said, they want you to keep an open mind, Aries. Okay. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectation. Mm -hmm. That's the first one. Okay. The other one that came out, and maybe I read them backwards, but no. The other one that came out said, you calling in your soulmate. Okay, so you calling in your soulmate. Your prayers and affirmations and visualizations help bring you together. So, first of all, you, you, you calling in a soulmate, okay? All right? But they tell you, hold up, Kimo uh, Your soulmate may differ from, you know, from your usual type and expectations, okay? So, Aries, keep that in mind. Open mind. Open mind. Mm-hmm. All right. Now, your love card says this, okay? It says that, uh, all right, you, uh, they call me a meathead, first of all, okay? You fussing, okay? You fussing. Yeah. Maybe you fussing because of this person here. This ain't the kind, you know, that ain't what you asked for. You know, that's like going that's like going to uh, one of them burger companies and asking for you a double meat cheeseburger with some jalapenos on. They get everything except the jalapenos, right? Okay, well, that's how you feel right now. Okay? But they tell you to keep an open mind because somebody came your way. But you don't feel like this your person. Mm -hmm. Look at here. You got the final two, the two of rings, okay? Look at here. Skills are being balanced for you, Aries. All right? This your person. Mm-hmm. Watch out now. And look here, Aries. They're saying take a leap of faith. Go here, baby. They want you to take a risk with this person. That's what... I'm just reading the card, baby. I'm just telling you what they say. They want you to take a leap of faith, okay? Go and take a risk, Aries. Mm-hmm. All right? This is a rebirth, a renewness, okay? Something new. All right, uh, this is supposed to be something good for you. All right, see that cup of love? Now, you feel like this person might either be too young for you. Maybe this person too thin. Maybe you like somebody with look meat on their body, on their bones. Mm -hmm. Okay, maybe you feel like she's of a different uh, race or uh, skin too light or too dark, but uh, mm -hmm. they said light. But here it is. You manifested this. They already told you you manifested this. <laughs> now look at Aries. Here you are over here chilling like a villain. Trying to keep everything cool. All right? Chilling like a villain. Mm -hmm. I take this also as like a, you know, like the temperance card. All right? You ain't trying to do too much or nothing. Mm -hmm. Just holding on. Yet holding on, my brother. Our sister. You ain't wearing no rose colored glasses. Mm -mm. But uh look like uh you ain't trying to move forward. This is like a too big again, continue card. Mm -hmm. This is like, yeah, you just uh, on a cliffhanger. You just either somebody left you hanging or you left yourself hanging. All right. So pretty much when you called in your soulmate, mm -hmm, this is you over here. You trying to stay cool, calm, and collect about it, right? All right, yeah, to be continued, meaning you holding on, you waiting, okay? Like in hermit mode. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you actually want somebody that's going to give you quality time, right? Yep, yep, yep. You want quality time with, with who your person coming in. And it looks like it could be a king of wands. It don't have to be, but it could be a king of wands. Somebody that's not good in the bedroom. Somebody either have children or don't have children or love children. Mm-hmm. All right. Very creative, optimistic, uh, enthusiast, enthusiast, have enthusiasm, mm -hmm. enthusiastic, fuck it. All right. And um, 
Yeah. Maybe even a person that liked the color red. Or oh, it's very sexual. Sexual healings. <laughs> All right. Well, you got the ten of wands here. Look like you say you're tired of waiting. <laughs> yeah, this is a burden on you. This is heavy. This is weighing heavy on you. But here it is. You're holding on. You got the strength. You got the stamina. Although you might have a little fear around it, but you're holding on, baby. Mm -hmm. You say you ain't giving up your snacks to nobody. All right? Two of Wands. If you're going to move forward or you're going to just stay balanced, okay? What you doing? You're trying to figure out which way your person coming in. All right? Yeah. Yeah, you, you trying to figure that. <laughs> you, <laughs> you looking. You looking for a love. <laughs> but look, you're about to have a new beginning, okay? Look like you decided you're going to stop waiting. You're going to stop looking around, okay? All right, that's the end to that, okay? You've been waiting. You've been pondering. You're trying to figure it out. Is this the one? Is that the one? Is that the one? Okay? So you're putting the end to that, okay? All right? So you got some new opportunities just ahead of you. All right? You're going to start seeing things a little different now. You may even get out and do some traveling, okay? All right? We also know that World Card talks about what? All right? New opportunities? Mm-hmm. Taking a trip, closing off old cycle. Yeah, you're getting rid of some stuff that you don't know no longer serve you, right? I know it. Getting rid of that or having to sit around and, and yeah, you always call you baby. That's been on your mind for a while. Here, look at that. you got the two cups. You want somebody you can share with, all right? Somebody you can have a heart to heart conversation with. Y'all can even get down to the nitty gritty when it comes to talking, all right? They're having that passionate conversation. Y'all connecting. Boy, y'all connecting about all eight eight barrels of firing off, okay? Mm-hmm. She pouring to you and you pouring into her, vice versa. Look at that big-ass cup. I ain't but one big-ass cup. Wait a minute. Yeah, there's two cups. Okay, but there's one big-ass cup in the middle of both of them, right? And then they got the other big-ass cup in the back, which is... Yeah, and they got fish riding around it, okay? So, yeah, this is going to be a very emotional and, and a loving relationship, Aries. All right? This could also have something to do with Pisces here because I see Pisces down here on this card. Mm-hmm. I sure do. Scorpio Council Pisces. It's a Pisces card. All right, on this Two of Cups. But look at that. Instead of having a, uh, instead of having mistletoe, they have a heart over the top. So anytime they in this tree, what happens? There's nothing but love there. Okay, you can't bring nothing less than love. Mm -hmm. I feel your cup, you feel mine. We sip from the same wine at one time. Part of the same vine of love. Yes, indeed. All right. Okay. Well, one more thing. One more thing, Mr. and Mrs. Aries. This person coming in a stable. Marriage material. Hello. Mm-hmm. This person can handle their own and yours, too, if they have to, need be. Mm-hmm. This person is very charismatic, knows how to handle themselves in any setting. And guess what, Aries? Oh. Uh, Keep an open mind because your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. All right. All right, Aries. I hope you enjoyed your breakfast message. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. You were doing some daydreaming. Mm-hmm. About what your person going to look like. Yes, indeed. Yeah. You was on that manifestation. Mm-hmm. Calling in your soulmate, using that telepathy. You surely was. And guess what, Aries? They say you're going to be very happy. Just the happiest card in the deck, the sun card. All right? Your sense of well-being, happiness, energy. I mean, you're going to have burst of energy. Yeah, yeah. Feeling real vitalized, revitalized. Mm-hmm. And sexy. So let's let it stop. We're going to stop right there. All right? See you in the next video, Aries. Yay, yay.